Right boys, here we are. Welcome to PSG Before We Were Famous, our one season challenge using the Mad Scientist 2006-2007 database, episode number three. Last episode, we had that brilliant 2-0 win against Leon. Since then, form has been pretty good. Just two blips, a home draw against Nice, followed up by a 3-0 defeat at Stanford Ends. Bernard Mendy getting sent off in 20 minutes and we really, really struggled. We have got Leon again today apologize for that but it was a big game it's the league cup semi-final it's january transfers we've not had there's more stuff going out than in so um perry alan fra everyone wants him now but he's doing pretty well for us um in league look three uh, five goals in three starts 8.9 average rating he has got flu we've got a flu pandemic in the squad which i'll show you in a minute even though i've sent the first person home we've still managed to catch three others have still managed to catch the flu um Armandi's going, he's done my head in, very, very good player, he's kind of back up anyway, because we have got Evra, um, not ideal, because my backup fullback, Paolo Cesar, the right back, just keeps getting injured, like, all the time, and shock, he's one of the players that has got flu, that cannot play today, um, so it leaves potentially a little bit short, um, but we'll go with it, there's no European football or anything, so we'll, we'll kind of risk it. Um, I am trying to bring in a central midfield. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to bring in a central midfielder on loan. Um, Dorosu is going. He's 33. He's leaving. He's in the reserves, I think, on the under-19s now. And Heli Book is a winger that we've we've never played, basically. Um, he's had one appearance in the league, done pretty in League Cup, done pretty well. But he's going. We're getting about 2 million quid for him or something, 1.7, um, which we'll take. Finance-wise, I've had to shift some money over. We did add 6 million in, but we were overspending by 500,000. I've just had a bid rejected, loan bid rejected for Roy Mackay, they wanted too much of his wages paying up front, we couldn't afford all of his 60 grand wages um, so we're just settling for Lee Catamull, 18 year old on loan to the end of the season 5k, 5K a week, 5.5k a week um, a player who's hated in English football but I always rated him just because he seemed to always get everything, work hard all he's going to do is kick shit out of people. We've got two positions in there. It does mean that we don't have to play Rosenthal in there and we can just save him as backup as being a centre-half. So it just gives us them extra bodies. The league, the bottom teams are quite poor, so we may be able to rest a couple of players when we play sort of like the bottom six or seven teams maybe um, and we're expected to dominate home games. But the squad itself is looking a bit thin. As you can see, we've got Alonso out with flu, Cesar Oh no, he's got a proper injury. 10 days and 3 weeks. Frau out. Flu. Diane out. Flu. So 3 out with flu. And then Cesar out injured as well. And Galado is also injured. He's been out for a little while. He's missed a couple of games. Pulled and leaned Neil Gimmin. So we are really missing him. Because he is our absolute creator. So today we've we've tried to play the two up front. It doesn't work together, Paula. I just prefer to be up there on himself. He's been in decent enough form. There you go. Rested in the last game. We've just played Nancy in the cup. In the F this is the League Cup we're playing today, semi-final. We've just gone through with a second string side as well. Um decent result against Sedan, the bottom club absolutely smashed them six nil. So we're in decent form. Leon themselves, whereas the league table looks like that. We have got a big, big gap at the moment. Leon have kind of fallen away a little bit. Following the defeat to us, which is up here, they had another defeat, another defeat there, a draw, a draw there, a draw there. They have responded after the little winter break, after Christmas with, with four wins on the trot, but couple of them in cup games as well. So three of them in cup games, so only one league win. Right, let's get into it. Parc de, Parc de France, Parc de Princes, whatever it's called. So you notice that the face pack is the old face pack, just because it's too much of a ball, like just to swap, just to swap everything round. Um, I am on my fourth video of the night. This is Wednesday night, early hours of Thursday morning, and it is 2.04 a.m. So, yeah. I didn't want to make more work for myself. Right, here we go. You deserve to be in the final. I want to win because it's a one season challenge. It'd be nice to it'd be nice to win as many trophies as I can. I don't know how history wise. Oh, it's only been going a couple of years. It's only been going since 94, 95. I think this is the competition now that actually I think the French affair 
have actually scrapped. I think the 2019-20 season was going to be actually the last season that they were actually going to play. So look, CC is injured. So where's Lee, where's Lee Catamore when you need him? Right, let's make a sub. Let's get Rosenthal on as a halfback. Let's just demand a little bit more. We haven't been like amazing possession wise and playing brilliant stuff. It's just that we've we've seemed to be maybe not the Sedan game when we won six 0 but we've just been clinical. Balls in the box. Paulette again at the near post. He is in. The veteran. Good strike. He just seemed to get to the near post pretty well and gets on the end of things. Right, Clement. Oh, he's been tackled. Shit, they've got a break on now. Janinho, Chris, the Brazilian. Sydney Guru's in the side today. Can we get a tackle in? Tackle, tackle, tackle. Oh, right. Keeper's got it. He's rolled it out to Yepes. Come on, boys. We just want a little bit. A little bit more. It says we're in control, but nothing's really happened highlight-wise apart from that. <clears throat> one Pauletta chance. I'm just going to say we're better. Let's get them finished off. So they are in great form. Kalou. Everett. Tackled. Kalou. Pauletta, that near post, but we're well defended. Pankrat, who's having to play today. Hasn't played at all, but his statistics say, sorry, his attributes are pretty good. There's Pauletta at the near post. Oh, he's had two, well, three chances. Three chances at the start of the second half. Right, Janino's got a beautiful right foot. Chris just over the bar. We've survived. Right, let's get Rothen off. He's been quite poor recently. Uh, Rodriguez actually played the cup game against Nancy and got himself a couple of goals, so he can get himself on the youngster. Right, let's get Pauletta off. Let's get Lion, Lion Dula on. Right, here we go. 90th minute. There's a highlight coming. Benzema, the youngster. Abidal. Tiago. What a team Leon had, by, had, by the way, during this era. Tiago. Are they going to clinch? An unlikely win. Maluda. Headed to Benzema. Gavu's underneath it. Well defended. Everett. And now it's our chance to break. Kalu. Who's not ideal in the advanced playmaker. He's having to do it. Line Dula's in. He's in. He's in. He's put it in. What a way to win the game. Nothing better than scoring a last minute winner. Lion Dula. On the score sheet, Kalu, brilliant run. He's got big boots to fill with filling in for Galado, but Lion Dula has absolutely smashed that one in. And we have taken a very, very late lead. And there we go, final whistle. What a way to win the game. Well done, boys. Completely deserve it. Blah, blah, blah. We are absolutely romping at the moment. So this is episode three. I'm having, maybe aiming to do maybe three more. Three more and that's it. It does make it easier that there's no, uh, no European Cup football. I'm not going to do another season. Um, I kind of do and I don't. I've, I've kind of, this is like the bottom of my list save because we've got York City, Fenerbahce, Man United, Genoa going at the moment as well with my stream and I'm wanting to stream more. We've, me having more time at home, it actually makes it more harder for me to record because the little ones at home, I normally record on two days when he's at school and I get it all in. So now this is why I'm recording at 10 past two at night, at early hours of the morning. So I've got to make a little bit of a sacrifice and PSG will be the one. I did say to start with it was going to be a one season save, but we'll keep going because I am enjoying it. I am enjoying it. I'm having a little bit of fun just flicking through the archive let me know down in the comments if you've got your own it's mad scientist 2006 07 database save let me know down in the comments we will come back we're going to plow right on um play a team obviously we're not going to play monica uh, leon again uh we'll come down maybe around here monaco maybe we might do monaco should we do Monaco? Yeah, let's go. Let's go Monaco. So next episode will be the Monaco game. We've got some big ones to go. We've already played Marseille on the save as well. Um, Marseille, then Nantes in the cup.
Bordeaux, Auxerre. I think Auxerre are going quite well. Yeah, they're up in, in fifth. So they're going quite well. So, yeah, Marseille down. Marseille way down. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Thank you for everyone who has subscribed to the channel recently. Absolutely fantastic numbers. Muchly appreciated. And, yeah, we'll aim on three more episodes after today. So that gives us a nice six-part mini-series. And the next one will be Monaco. Cheers, guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, all that kind of thing. See you later.